must save her. My daughter. Oh my gosh. I was just about to do my intro and I saw the shooting star. Oh man. How's it going guys? This is Lucian Sword and today we are doing episode number 30 which is going to be a one hour special. Unfortunately that shooting star is way too far away so I can't go get it. Unless, unless I bomb blast over there but I don't really want to because I want to go for these two towers, guys. That is the name of the video for a reason. Did you guys see that dude over there? Am I seeing things? Wait, there is a dude over there. Look at his green tongue. Oh, that is cool. Anyways. And a bunch of luminescent stones over there. I gotta stay focused. I gotta stay focused. Alright, let's go for these two tower, guys. Hopefully I don't burn alive trying to get there. Because I almost burned alive last time I did a shrine over in this area, which was last episode. Okay, we're burning. We're burning. Okay, okay. Let's put the uh, let's put that weapon away, maybe. Ow, 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 ow. Come on. There we go. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. So I can't get too close to the lava or I'm just going to burn alive. But I know that we can get this tower over here without dying. Because I've done it before. We just got to be very careful. Man, that is so beautiful. I think the, the best thing about this game are the views. I wish it would go even further than what you see here. But this is a great start. And the Switch is not the most powerful system. So, oops. Actually, you know what we do need, guys? We need Wolf Link in here. Wolf Link is great at helping get rid of annoying people like this this guy right here. Okay, he don't want to come. Fine. So anyways, let's keep going towards this tower, baby. I hope I don't burn alive. We're going to have to climb this. Oh, wow. I'm so fast at climbing. I do really need to go upgrade my armor some more. And I need to find the other... Wow, look at that view. Ooh, a shrine, guys. A shrine. I'm marking it. Hold, hold, hold. Alright, purple mark is a shrine right in between the two towers. Perfect. Oh, man, that tower actually looks... <laughs> the more, the closer we get to it, the more difficult it, it seems to be uh, to, to be looking. Uh, let, let's quickly climb up here. I think we're uh, getting pretty close to the tower. We might be able to bomb blast to it if I find a good spot. But that is the key. You gotta find a good spot. Actually, we might be able to bomb blast to the second tower from this first tower. Oh man, Death Mountain looks so cool in this game. Please don't start me on fire. Please don't start me on fire. Wow, look at all those platforms. That's the most I've ever seen in one spot. We are definitely going to fly down to those platforms to see what's up with those after we get this tower. Oh, whoa, whoa. Hey, whoa. Okay, okay, okay. Let's stop going down. I want to go up. No, like, uh, let's go up. Oh. The mountain is just steep enough so that I can't easily walk up it, but I can climb it pretty fast. So how are you guys doing today? How are you guys? I am just uh, drinking water today while I record. I already had my tea. I feel pretty great. I wanted to make this video yesterday, but I just got kind of busy. But today... Nothing was going to keep me from recording this. I've been thinking about it a lot. We are very close 
to getting enough shrines to get the master sword. I mean, I still need like 10 or 11 more shrines, but I mean, when we started this, I needed it a lot more than that. There it is. Look how close I am, guys. All right. I think we can maybe fly to it now. Pretty close. Let's get a little taller here. A little bit up higher. Probably a Korok at the top of this mountain anyways. Unless I start burning to death, then I might have to, you know, jump down kind of quick. All right. This this is actually, I could bomb blast to it, but I don't even think I need to. Anything at the top? Ooh. That... Oh. <laughs> the butterfly started on fire. That butterfly is actually useful. Although, those are hot springs down there. They actually heal you. Oh, look at that. There's platforms right there. The the hot springs do heal. Okay, that one has a chest. That one has a golden chest. So really, that one is where we should be going. I don't even know if you can get there. Oh, that's the shrine we saw. Alright. Let's do it. I'm going to jump towards the tower. We're going to try to get it. This is the first time that I'm going for the Death Mountain Tower before the, like, Gerudo Desert Tower. Sorry, Elden Tower. Grab it, Link! Oh my... <sighs> he wouldn't grab it. Uh, let's do a stamina recovery food. I got a lot of them. No worries, no worries. Gosh, do you know how heavy a sword that big would be in real life? Probably like 200 pounds. I mean, it is a massive sword of metal. Unless it's hollow, but then it wouldn't be very strong. I'm kind of surprised we're not burning, but maybe the altitude is like keeping it a little bit cool. All right. Last leg. We got it. And then we're going to go straight to that other tower over there. Actually... Should I go for the shrine? Yeah, let's do the shrine. Then I could teleport back up to this tower, and then I can bomb blast to the other tower. Maybe I'll do that. We'll see. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yeah, we made it. We made it. We made it. Take a breather. Oh yeah. Alright, let's get this shrine. This, this, <laughs> I almost called it a shrine. Let's get this tower. I'm gonna take a sip of water. Oh yeah, boys! Eight minutes into the episode, and we already got the tower? Oh man, that is some excellent progress. This tower is actually awesome because you get to see Death Mountain on the map, finally. And it looks awesome. Mostly because you can see all the lava. Bloop! Oh, look at that. So awesome. Who would have thought that the Korok Forest would be right underneath Death Mountain? Alright, um, let's see. Wow, that is a big jump. I might actually do the bomb blast just to get to that shrine. Alright, guys. Oh, look at that. This is our first kind of up-close look at the Divine Beast of the Gorons. I forget what he's called. Look at that. Even his feet are on fire. So cool, man. So cool. Alright, uh, where was I? Oh, yes. We're gonna do something along these lines here. There's actually a stable down there as well. It's a stables shrine. We're gonna do some, something like this. Uh, just give me a sweet spot here. Gonna do something like this. You know you got a good launch when you're like breaking the game with lag.
cool little pirate ship thing down there in the water, too. Or I guess it's not a ship, it's like a base. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you fly from the Elden Tower to the Mo'ash Keet Shrine. <laughs> and we'll check out that stables right after. Oh, look at that view. Beautiful. That was an awesome picture. I might use that for my background, to be honest. Had the mountain over there, had an untapped tower off in the distance. Unconquered shrine in the forefront. That's what it's all about, baby. That is what it's all about. Alright. Let's see what we got. Metal makes a path? This is just like the first shrine in the game. Oh my gosh, this is going to be easy. I mean, there's a little more lava, a little more balls, but other than that, it's not a big deal. We're just going to grab this one right here. Wait, can I not do it when it's under stasis? Oh, that was fast. Did you see how fast it went down? Um, maybe I gotta actually grab it from up top. That's fine. About like this. Actually, there's a chest up there. So I guess if, if I have this ball, another ball won't won't drop. All right. Uh, I think I'm gonna need you, so just don't move for a second. This is literally recycling a shrine. Come on, Nintendo. Why you gotta do the same shrine in, twice in one game? Uh, I don't have like any one-handed weapons other than the Demon Carver and the Guardian Sword Plus Plus, of course. So, sorry, Knights Claymore. You're a good weapon. But, ah, where'd, my, where'd my silver ball go? Gosh dang it. Come back, come back. Come back, come back. Oh. Oh, hi. All right, let's just take this big old ball. Bring it on over here. Don't get killed by the little balls over here. Even more little balls over here. No, back. Back. Ah. Ah. My magnesis is too strong. That literally was the easiest shrine of my life. It's the same thing as the very first shrine you do in the game, almost. The Magnesia Shrine. <sighs> Spirit Orb number two. He looks like he's just about ready to stand up. Hmm. Scorching climates. In the extreme heat of volcanic regions, ingredients will cook simply by placing them on the ground. Oh. That's actually really useful knowledge. Actually a good tip. Alright. We got the shrine, baby. We are only 15 minutes in. I already got a tower and a shrine. Way ahead of schedule, guys, because we are doing a one-hour video. Alright, let's talk to Beetle. Foothill Stables. What's up, guys? Just, just, uh, just dropping in. Let's see what you got, Beetle. Wow. Actually, a sledgehammer there. I'm probably gonna take it. Uh, yeah, sure. You could have the beetle, dude. I know you are obsessed with beetles, Beetle. Just take it. I don't care. You obviously want it way more than I do. <laughs> Let's take all the arrows he has. Just clean out his stock. We're gonna take the, uh, the these arrows as wow. well. And I think we're also going to take the uh, the hardy lizard. All, uh, no, we'll take all of them. Actually, that's a lot of money. But, you, you know what? We'll, we'll take one of them. We'll take one. Wow. 
Alright. Let's, uh, let's sell. Oh. Hmm. Let's sell, uh, some of uh, the monster parts. How about... We got a lot of these. Let's sell 35 of those. Only 100 rupees? Wow. Alright, these are worth 8 each. Uh, let's sell like 50 or 60 of these. This will get us a lot of money. Wow. That landed right on 60. Oh, okay, 480. Alright, alright. Oh, these are worth 20 a piece? Alright, let's sell, uh, let's sell 20 of them. <laughs> and, uh, let's sell some of these. I mean, I never use monster parts for the most part, so they're pretty much... I know you can make elixirs with them and whatnot, but... Uh, let's sell 20 of these, but I, I really don't make elixirs, but mainly I just make food. I, I see elixirs as being, like, not as good as food. The only time I would use an elixir... Oops. I was gonna sell some more, but whatever. I got a lot of money. Only time I use elixir... <gasps> it's good. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, Cass. Excuse me. You surprised me so much, you made me cough. Um, before we talk to Cass, I do need to make some, uh, something that will protect me against heat, right? Stamina, stamina, stay cool, endure the bitter cold, against electricity, movement speed, actually that's... Let's actually do a couple a fiver. Let's do a fiver on the movement speed, so I, in case I want to be really fast. Oh yeah. Is there nothing I have that actually protects against, uh, you know, heat? I'm not gonna do a cooking with Lucian, but I I do want to cool stuff. Increase your. There we go. Heat resistance. All right, let's put a couple of those in with like a bird thigh. See what we get. All right, five minutes of level one heat. That's probably not gonna be enough. We need fireproof, not just heat resistance. Hmm. All right, let's try. Let's try a couple of those. Uh, makes me feel warm and fuzzy. Alright, we'll cook one of those. Made two of those, and then a monster part. So we'll do a Lizolfo's Talon. Are you kidding? What? Alright, I give up. Forget it. Forget I even tried. Oh, that's how you make a fireproof elixir. You need the lizard, the fireproof lizard, and a monster part. It's actually very, uh, very useful knowledge. Hey, it's May Mayo Mayro. I wish I had this kind of artistic skill. No kidding, that looks like a photograph, oh. dude. Oh. Azunda made this picture. Um. Okay. A shrine quest? Interesting. Hey, Cass, what's up, dude? Oh. Ah, we meet yet again. How are you holding up? In case you were wondering about the song I performed at the stables, there are many theories about its origin. But according to my teacher, it was a song performed by the ancient hero to call to his horse companion. <laughs> if you ever feel like hearing it, feel free to drop by. Anyway, time to get back to it. No, I'm not going to hear you this song. Oh. The same song every time. Come on, guys. Come on. Uh, you know what, guys, though? Nah, I, I, I want the sledgehammer, but... Oh, the double axe, too. It's a lot of good good weapons over at this shrine. Just for breaking open crates, you know what I mean? But that's basically what my Zora sword is here for, so... Let's just uh, loot this uh, stables up. Get everything we can. And uh, we'll, we'll move on from here. Probably to that other uh, tower. I don't even need this food, but I'm hoping he'll drop like something a little bit better. All right, five arrows. All right, all right. It's actually a lot of stuff here. 
I wish that you could resurrect your horse at the stables, not at the horse god, but... Alright, now... Ooh. Is that a blizzard rod? It might be. I'm gonna upgrade my cold rod to a blizzard rod real quick here, guys. That might be a blizzard rod. If, if it's even a chance, I gotta go for it, you know what I mean? You did not see me. Uh, it's just an ice rod. Alright, well, I'll drop mine just in case this one has a little bit more durability. I doubt it does, because I don't even think I use this one, but... Whatever, now we got a brand new ice rod. You know what I just realized? There wasn't a doggy at that shrine, at that uh, stables. Usually there is. Oh, wow. That tower looks like you're supposed to take this path. I don't even see the path marked on the map. I bet you're supposed to do that. Let's, uh... Let's warp back up to this tower, get a better view. So we can, uh, try to make a plan on how we want to approach the second of the two towers. Because it looks a little bit more like a fortress, uh, kind of like the Forsaken Fortress in Wind Waker, actually. Except, you know, it's not an island. Uh... Yeah, when I did the bomb blast, I only made it like halfway. Then again, I probably could have made it all the way. What is that sparkling sound? Do you guys hear that? Oh, it's my it's my rod. All right. Um. Yeah. Let's just. Uh, that looks so interesting down there too. But focus, focus. We're gonna go to this tower. Are you kidding me? Man, I just cannot get the bullet time right now. I just did it. There we go. Oops. It didn't detonate. It did not detonate. Try that again. Oh my! <laughs> it's so hard sometimes to do this. And like, why is it inconsistent? Am I not in the right spot? Like, am I not putting my heart into this? Okay, okay. Let me line it up again. <gasps> Feels bad. This one's a little more difficult to get off, but I know it's possible because we just did it. I just, the, the square bomb wouldn't detonate for some reason. I thought I was pushing the button. Must have been a user error, but that's all right. We will get it. I wish they made these little, little uh, thingies on the towers just an inch taller and it would be perfect, but no. Maybe it's the the bomb arrow, man. That's or the fire arrow. That's just throwing me off. All right. I feel like right here is the sweet spot. <laughs> oh, come on, Link! Stop being such a baby. Why? There we go. This one's probably gonna kill me. Okay, maybe not. All right, it was good. It was a good one. Finally got it. This will cut our travel time, like, in half. Oh, wait, there's another shrine over here? Kind of oh, there's another stables right there. Ooh. We need, we need to eat real quick. Running out of stamina. 
Okay, there's a shrine right there. Oh! There's actual drones. Okay. Drones protecting this awesome fortress tower. Very cool. Angry uh, bokoblins down there. I feel like we're going to start the, uh, the ascent right here. Why is he so angry? Oh snap, there's actually a dude right there. Let's go help the dude real quick. Why you can't put the armor, ancient armor on Epona is still annoying to this day. Hey, big guy, leave him alone. Monsters have no business being here. Wait, he survived? I can't, I can't shoot down there though. Oh, hold up. I can't. I... Okay. All right, he ran away. He ran away. We good? Yeah, we good. What's up now? Mm. Do you know the story behind that castle there? No, no. Tell mm. us about it. That's the Akala Citadel ruins. Long ago, at the peak of Hyrule's power, they built a fortress to protect Akala. It was said to be unassailable. But during the Great Calamity, Hyrule Castle fell. The army had no royalty to lead them. With no other choice, they fell back to the Citadel to make the last stand. Uh. Sadly, a concentrated assault from the out-of-control guardian spelled the end for this fortress too. I mean, it actually looks perfectly intact. Like, there's hardly any damage. In a real sense, the Kingdom of Hyrule met its doom here. I found out my own kin died in that battle, so I came to at least pray at the spot where they fell. But it turns out that the old guardians are still active, so this is as far as I go. Oh. I've never heard of anyone else escaping a guardian's sights, at least. You don't look reckless enough to chance it, but be on your guard in these hills all the same. <laughs> I want that golden chest, too. <laughs> Man, that's kind of sad. This is literally where the uh, the Hyrule army fell. Ooh, hardy radish over here. Oh no, it's a poor helpless fox. Better run away, fox, before Wolf Link smells you. I don't know where he is, but there he is. <coughs> All right, we can... Uh, we could turn the shrine sensor off. We know where the shrine is. I'm not scared of a little drone. I got some bomb arrows and a wolf. That's all I need. Might need stasis as well. <laughs> Surely those drones have metal inside of them. Why can't I magnesis the drone? You know what I mean? Of course, my bow breaks right when the drone is looking at me. And Wolf Link led his gaze straight to me as well. Alright guys, I guess it's time for the Mighty Lionel Bow. How dare you! Bombs away, boy.
Back off. Back off. Really, dude? You really want to mess with me right now? I didn't think so. Well, I guess we got past the drone. Probably another one, but... Man, I thought for sure I'd break one of his uh, propellers. They gotta be weak. I wish the damage would show on each... Oh, a silver boy. Hi. I kind of want him alive. Oh, never mind. I was going to say I would like his loot, but... Oh, well. Okay, alright. Here's another one. You see nothing. You see... Nothing. Am I supposed to use this... This crate? Oh yeah, actually it does work. No. No, I'm not here. <laughs> He's like, must have been nothing. <laughs> this is like Skyrim or Oblivion. Just go, just go, there's nothing here. You saw, no, 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 there's nothing. Nobody's here. No, 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 I wish I could hit him with it, but he's just out of my range. Nope. Nope. Just, just scooting by. Just scooting on by. Oh my gosh, it worked. He still thinks I'm over there. Amazing. We fooled him, guys. We fooled the drone. Oh. Wolf Link, do not give away our position. Dang it! Ah! Dang, Wolf Link! He killed us! Wolf Link got us killed again! He chose to respawn at the worst time oh I should have shot bomb arrows at that thing man if I start at the bottom I am gonna be a little bit annoyed okay I don't think I did maybe I did did I probably yeah yeah this is this is definitely the bottom uh, what I don't have a shield equipped all right just get out of here just get out of here Alright, we're not spawning Wolf Link this time. He is in punishment. Because that was stupid. We had the 200 IQ play and everything. Nothing here. That is so funny. Alright. We would have been fine. So let's see if we could do it again. There's another one up here. We gotta wait till he goes.
Couple big boys. Couple, uh, couple silver boys over here. Alright. Well, Flink, we can use you now. Fine. Whatever. Whatever. I, I admit you help us more than you hurt us. Maybe. Maybe. That's a strong maybe. But we'll give you some apples. Hopefully you eat them before jumping into battle. Okay. Oh, alright. Alright. Big boy sword. This guy's actually really strong. Ow. Time to put on the heavy armor, guys. I really don't want to die again. I have so many of these hardy things. Let's just use them. No! wanted his loot! I really wanted the loot. Uh... Man, I should have been smarter on that. And not hit him off the cliff right when he's about to die. This guy's not that smart for a yellow for a silver. Oh Wolflink, you uh you unteleported. Cool. You know what, dude? Just get out of here. Get out of here! All right, well, we didn't get the loot from either one. That kind of stinks, but oh well. All right, um, let's just climb right up here and I think we can uh, pretty much get the tower. Ooh, good call, good call. Oh, never mind. Uh, all right, guess I didn't really need this armor that much. Actually, it is a little bit cold. Put on the warm doublet. Oh, and there's blight. Wolflink, do not teleport in and wake this guy. Good boy. You actually listened for once. Okay. Man, this tower is pretty tough to get. Whoa, look at all the cannons and stuff over here. Some fireflies? Oh man, what are you aiming at? Oh, the road. The road that leads to the, uh, to the keep. That's actually pretty awesome. Um, dang. Awesome views up here. Def oh yeah, we gotta remember to get that shrine and mark it. Wolf, get, get, wolf. Okay. Don't fall off the cliff like Cookie. Alright, um, yeah. Let's just let's go like this. Oh, hi. Nice. We found a secret. Nice. 
Let's go kill this guy because he's probably going to drop us a ruby. I don't want to hit him off. Oh, that was nice. Oh! Ten ice arrows and an opal. This place is crazy. I don't really feel like fighting that guy. Die from the the blight. Oh, he la he didn't land in the blight. Oh, I just realized we can't even get up the tower. Ew. Um, I didn't realize the blight was all over the tower. All right. God, come on, come on. We can get up that, right? Probably yeah, I, I can use this. Oh. oh. We can't. Oh, okay. Are you sure? Oh, it is too cold. Hey, we got it. It's very cold. Alright. Fine. You win. I'm pretty sure there's more loot to be had in this area, but I'd rather just get the tower right now. Stay focused, get the tower, then we can loot all we want. Although, to be honest, I'm probably just going to go straight for the shrine after this. Can we get two towers and two shrines? Yes, we can. That is the answer. And we will. Here we go. Another shrine right there. All right, gonna mark it. Maybe we can do three shrines and two towers in this episode, guys. That would just be amazing. Oh, this is it. We made it to the top. Oh, man, we only have a few towers left after this one, guys. Oh, my gosh, I almost, almost didn't make it. Oh, that was tiring, eh, Link? Oh, yeah. We had to battle a lot, man. We had to go through drones and everything actually died once trying to get a tower but this is probably the most historically significant tower in the game on the other side of death mountain good progress though good progress Nice. Link, you look totally mismatched. Maybe I should uh, get my warm doublet uh, painted. Actually, if we go to the Rito place, we can get the beautiful warm clothes. I think I'll go there next. Next episode, guys, we're heading to the Rito village. Maybe. There's just so much to do where I'm at. Including, look at that skull lake up there. There's a labyrinth up there. There's the spiral peninsula place or sand bar uh, there's a uh, I think the eight the uh, what's it called the, there's another ancient tech lab if we follow that road all the way up there that's where we get the ancient uh, armor ancient arrows ancient bow all that good stuff so I'm probably gonna head there but first let's take a look around so all right there's one shrine right there and there's another way over there I want them both. Alright. You know what, guys? Can I fly that far? That is really far. 
Let's go for this shrine first. And then the other one! Oh yeah, we're gonna make it! Shrine. I got what you need. Man, we might do four shrines in one episode. That would be a record, I think. If I'm really fast, we can do this one, warp to the tower, and do the other one. Just depends how hard the shrine is, to be honest. I have no idea what, what we're getting into here. Ah! Minor test of strength. Alright, I'm glad we came. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Right, boys? Watch me get killed. Um, I mean, I've been saving guardian weapons. Might as well use them. You really want some of this, big boy? You want some of that? Do you really want some of this? Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Oh no, where are you going? I'm not done with you. <laughs> That wasn't even my best guardian weapon and you died that fast. Pathetic. I will take that ancient battle axe. Thank you very much. Giant ancient core. Very worth. Very worth. Oh man, we did that shrine so fast! Was that like one minute? That was probably the fastest shrine I've ever done. Oh man, we are easily, easily going to that other shrine. Is that, my, wait, is this the second or third one I did? I don't even remember. I've been playing for almost an hour, I don't remember. I think that was... The second? Oh, man, I, I'm so bad. I'm so bad. Somebody, somebody's keeping track out there in the audience, right? So, somebody is. <laughs> I need you guys to help me out. All right. Um, uh, we, the, we could explore this area very, very well. So we could. There's probably a fairy in this here grass. This is, this is sacred looking grass. If I ever saw some sacred grass. Wait a minute, you're not Wolf Link. You, you guys aren't Wolf Link. Come, come closer again, I dare ya. Oh, you, you really want to pick on me? Do you guys know who I'm friends with? Do you, do you guys know who I'm friends with? Look what he just did to me, Wolf. Come on, come on, Zumbor. Look at, they're bullying me. They're bullying. You went for the apple? You want to go eat when, when I'm dying over here? 
I swear to God, you give me the apple. You know what? Bad boy. I'm taking all the apples. You get you get rewarded after you get the job done. Not before. No, don't look at the steak. Don't look at the steak. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Bark them away, man. <sighs> Gotta do everything myself around here. There's a shrine way out there. Oh, nice. It's on the way to the... Uh... Alright, cool. Um, Alright, let's warp back up to Akala Tower real quick. Jump down and get that other shrine. We got plenty of time, boys. We got plenty of time. We did the two towers. We got the Elden Tower and the Akala Tower. We got at least two, three, maybe four shrines in one episode. Dang. Alright, now there was a shrine just right below the tower somewhere. Let's find it. Right below the tower. Okay, it was literally right there. Whee! Oh, there's a stable down there too. That's cool. Pretty awesome looking uh, place right there, I, if I say so myself. Zikasho Shrine. Next to the Citadel. Man, if I'm really fast, we could maybe even do another shrine. Maybe I'm getting a little bit too ambitious. Zikasho Apalates. Oh. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh. Oh. Is this supposed to be a challenge? Easy. Easy. What is this? What is what is going on here? Oh yes. I remember this. Can I just real carefully can I just go under this or no. Oh! Wait, I could just run through it. <laughs> Easy! But wait. I see. thing is straight on the bottom all right all right yolo got it Would have rather have taken some arrows, to be honest. I do like the Fennec, bro. It's just so dang weak. Wait. Dang it! I didn't even need to drop the bow! It was a weapon I needed to drop. <sighs> I can be stupid sometimes. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess I'll just drop that one for this one. This one actually is an upgrade. Alright. That's a small upgrade. And to be honest, 
does look cooler, so, you know, there's that. Alright, next part of the shrine. What do we got? This looks kind of scary. Oh, <laughs> it's like Plinko. No, no, no. No, no, no. Easy. Easiest shrine of my life. Dang, guys. I did enough shrines in this video to get another heart container. And we still got a few minutes, so I'm gonna I'm gonna look around and see if we can do another shrine real quick. Oh man. I cannot wait, guys. Once we get the master sword, I can actually do the sword trials and all that. Oh, it's gonna be fun. That is the actual uh biggest challenge of master mode I hear are the sword trials, so I look forward to it. Mm. All right, let's go down to the stables. I don't like the rain, so let's just uh, let's let's sleep. Let's take a little nap, guys. We have worked really hard today. Let's just take a small break after I read this diary. Okay. Hi. Let's do the soft bed today. Oh. And let's get Epona and start heading up the uh, mountain pass. Oh. I did enjoy my stay, thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, sir, I would like my horse, please. Yeah. Got my horse. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Um, we want to go... Oh, there's actually two roads that both go to the same place. But, I guess we're gonna go this way. Finish the episode on a nice horseback little journey. Sometimes it feels good just to ride your horse. You know what I mean? I'm gonna ride till I can't no more. Uh-oh. Dude is under attack down there, but I, I took a, a, a bad turn. Okay, sorry. Yeah, I heard a Korok over there, but... <coughs> Excuse me. Whew. Let's go down this way, boys. Oh, it's a Gerudo. Savota. Savota. Mm -hmm. Fang and bone? Check your map for a pond in the north that looks like a skull. If it's not on there yet, you'll know it when you see it. The pond at night is where you'll run into Fang and bone. All right. Man, she got green lipstick. Um, keep it going, boys. Hello, person in need. I have come to save your life for a small price. You must pay. Apona, whose side are you on? Please, come on, man, come on. <laughs> wow, Link. 
Nice try. A for effort. Poke, 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 poke. He didn't even drop anything. All right, you better give me something. Oh, it's a chick. I didn't even notice. All right, monster act extract. Fang and bone. Wow, everybody, everybody is obsessed with the fang and bone. Apparently, it is the hottest shop in town. All right, guys, that is going to be it for this episode. Wow, we are finding all kinds of travelers on this road. Human, Gerudo, and Goron. Goron Hot Springs on the peak, on the way to the peak of Death Mountain. Yeah, dude, I actually have seen the hot springs myself. All right, guys, we might have to uh, loot that camp right there in a minute. They are getting way too excited over nothing because I am not going to do it right now. Yeah. All right, all right, big girl. I know, you're a big girl. You can handle a turn. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to end the episode on a horse ride, which is something I haven't done before. We are making our way towards that shrine up there. And whatever else might be up there. Apparently the Fang and Bone, the Skull Lake. Who knows what else? Looks like a drone down there. A couple drones, oh my. Alright guys, please like the video if you enjoyed. Please subscribe for more Zelda and Brawlhalla and other games. This is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next episode. Take it easy guys.